hey guys what's up so in this video we are going to solve question number 3 4 and 5 from NCRT exercise 8.1 so all the three questions are direct questions they are just based on the concept that I have repeated so many times uh, if one trigonometric ratio is given then how to find out the remaining five any one of them might be asked out of the five so here in this question also sin a is given to us as 3 by 4 so concept I have told you for like so many times just the concept is draw one triangle that's it so let's say this is a triangle this angle is angle a this is b this is c now sin is given as 3 by 4 sin is opposite by hypotenuse so opposite side will be 3 hypotenuse will be 4 right so what will be this side we need to find that side ab ab will be under root of 4 square minus 3 square so this we can solve by doing 4 minus 3 4 plus 3 so that will be under root of 7 so this side we will get it as root 7 now in question they are asking find the value of cos a and 10a so cos a what is the definition cos is adjacent divided by hypotenuse so adjacent side is with respect to angle a we are seeing so adjacent side is root 7 and hypotenuse is 4 so answer for cos is root 7 by 4 and 10 a the definition is opposite divided by adjacent so opposite side is 3 adjacent side is root 7 so answer is 3 by root 7 that's it for the third question now let's see question number 4 question number 4 also cot A is given to us as 8 by 50 and what is the definition of cot we know the definition for tan right which is toa so opposite by adjacent so this will be this will be reverse of that adjacent by opposite so adjacent side you can take it as 8 so let's mark this angle as angle A this is let's say B this is C this is 90 degree so uh, Okay, sorry for this uh, yeah so we can mark the sides here which is the adjacent side adjacent side will be 8 opposite side will be 15 so we need to find out side AC so AC will be under root of 8 square plus 15 square now 8 square means 64 and this will be 225 so overall you will get 289 and under root of 289 is 17 you need to remember this right 17 square is 289 remember this now it will be used in so many questions so this side we will get it as 17 and also this is also one of the important triplets 8 15 17 so you can add this one more triplet to your list okay so just try to remember this triplet also 8 15 17 okay now what will be the value of sin a sin is soka toa right so sin is opposite by hypotenuse so with respect to angle a we are seeing remember so opposite side is 15 and hypotenuse is 17 similarly what is the value of ck seek will be the reciprocal of cos right so what is the definition for cos a let's first find out cos a cos a is adjacent divided by hypotenuse adjacent side is 8 hypotenuse is 17 so seek will be the reciprocal of cos so 17 by 8 is the answer fine very easy again fifth one fifth one again seek theta is given to us as 13 by 12 now what is the definition for cos theta cos is so toa right so cos is adjacent divided by hypotenuse so seek is reciprocal of that so this will be hypotenuse divided by adjacent so you can just consider hypotenuse as 13 let's say this this angle is uh, this angle you can take it as theta okay so hypotenuse is 13 and adjacent side is 12 so this side is 12 so this side will be how much we can uh, like you can recall the triplet triplet is 5 12 13 so this side will automatically come out as 5 if you use Pythagoras theorem right so now we need to find out the value of all other trigonometric ratios so first of all let's find sine theta sin theta the definition is opposite divided by hypotenuse so opposite side is 5 with respect to angle theta we are seeing remember okay so opposite side is 5 hypotenuse is 13 so what will be the value of cosec theta now if we have sin theta cosec is just reciprocal of that 
then cos theta sec theta is already given so cos theta will be reciprocal of that so 12 by 13 we can say now what will be the value of tan theta tan theta is opposite divided by adjacent opposite side is 5 adjacent is 12 and cot theta will be reciprocal of that so 12 by 5 understood all the three questions yes so that's it for this video see you in the next video take care bye bye